Well, hello there, good looking, and so welcome back to Makeup Mondays with Tracy Lifestyle, and that's me. Happy Monday, okay? Looks like we got a beautiful, gorgeous mustard yellow look going on today. Are you guys loving it? Because it's kind of been my go-to look. You know, one thing. Got some new little fun hoops to go with it, you know, the gold and all. So with no further ado, if you guys would like to see how I achieved this look, please keep on watching. Here we go. <laughs> June's over. June 9. <laughs> so, let's go ahead and get started. Do you see this big ass freaking nose piercing ring thing? It's a flower. But, I don't know. He's too big for my fucking nose. But, it's okay. What we gonna do first, since we're wearing yellow, right? We're gonna do yellow eyeshadow. What? So you know what that means. We're gonna go ahead and go into the Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette. It has gorgeous colors. Showed you all the colors before? Well, let's say them again. And of course, we're gonna go into Access Mustard Yellow looking color, right? Load it up on your brush like so. Ooh, pat it on top of your lid like so. You go ahead and be generous with this, you know? Pat it all over. It's funny, because I like avoided wearing eyeshadow for the longest time because it's just so addicting. Like I knew once I started wearing it, I would not want to stop. You know, and I don't, I didn't want like the whole wrinkly eyelids so quick, so that too. So that's also why you don't want to go so hard on your eyelids because they are very sensitive, you know? That's ugly. I mean, that's pretty much it. I don't do too much with that because it looks pretty nice just like that. If you want to blend this part with a little bit of like a, like a soft brown or something. But now we're going to go into the her palette again the fun colors which are my beautiful nails okay and of course we're gonna go in with this gorgeous freaking highlight color my hair is wet right now so don't like uh i don't know i i put on a little headband because i don't know here we go so with this fun beautiful freaking 24 gold we're gonna apply it to the inner tear duct right here we're gonna put it right here i like to go without the tear duct but Mondays, we've been looking a little tired, so tear duct is good. Okay, you see how that just brightens up your face already? Like, it makes me just want to sneeze. Then we're gonna go with some Tartiste, okay, Pro Glow 3. I love the packaging. It's so cute, look. Ooh. And it's magnetic. What? There's like a whole bunch of blush and bronzer shades. So we're gonna pick up both of these. And we're gonna do right here. Okay, and then once you got that on, put on some blush. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna go with this one. And then once we got that, there's some cute little highlight shades right here. I'm gonna go ahead and put that on her nose. Ooh, popping! I love, love it, love it, love. All over, all over. Mm. All right, let me look a little bit less crazy real quick. And uh, to be honest, I feel like I should start selling some since people always ask me where I get them. Same old deal, you know, you gotta put the lash glue, this is duo, onto the lash line. Totally have an eyeliner tutorial slash lash tutorial to show you guys. Maybe I'll do like an updated one where it's just lashes, you know? or lash and brow. Um, you're gonna go ahead and fan the shit out of this. I'm just kidding, don't do that. Uh, just put on your lip, you know? So when you're looking at your mirror, go like this, you know? So when you're seeing yourself, you, you look at yourself like this, all nostrils and all. And you're gonna go ahead and tilt your mirror under your chin, right? That way you can see your eyelash line. With your mirror under you like this, you're gonna go ahead and look down and then you can see your lash line. By the time you figure all of that out, your lashes will probably be tacky or whatever. And you are glorious. <laughs> Finally figured out my little hair situation for a bit. So back to the highlighting, right? Now we're going to go ahead. Well, I'm back in with our Tarte Pro Palette right here. Some of the highlighting shades, right? We'll go ahead and put that on our cheeks. 
Hey. Or cheekbones. Just her cheeks. I already like naturally like highlights right there. I'm sorry, I don't need to go. Just so caught up in my emotions. Well, skip this if you've already skipped it, but highlight your eyebrow bones, huh? Cover FX. For that clean look, added that way you can't see your little baby hair. Wax. Lash line and your lashes, oftentimes you're gonna see that little uh, skin part and like that just looks crazy on so many levels and just, you know so just get a black liner any liner this is perversion going on on pan <laughs> and you're just gonna go ahead and put that under your lash right it's tight lining so you're putting your eyeliner on your top lash then we go in back right to do the bottoms because it looks cute for now but then later it's just gonna like you know your mascara and blah 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 and nah, 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 nah. so what you do is you go in with back with the access color right and with access we're gonna go ahead and put that under our lash line again right So with the brown liner, any liner will do. This is a whiskey though, for of course, Urban Decay's 24/7 Glide On. Huh? You're gonna go ahead and tight line your bottom waterline. Okay, and I only like to do it to like right here, mid eye. You can do the whole waterline if you please, but I'm not going to, because I feel like it like it closes up your eye. Like it like you know you want to open up your eyes, not like shut them. And then of course our Explicit trick, right, is to do another, okay? So go ahead and load it back up, and then read that. Pat it if you please. But see, with the blending thing is if you focus it on your lid lid, and then bring the rest of the product back up to the crease, that'll be pretty much a blend right there, because then you're having nothing left pretty much when you get to the crease. And so you can just lightly diffuse it, right? And it's nice and bright. Don't y'all love it? Yellow eyes, yellow shirt on. Tracy Lifestyle. <laughs> so then after all of that, right? We're missing some lips. Mm -hmm. So what should we do? Put some mascara on first while we think. Better than sex, Too Faced. Just gonna do the base of our lashes because you if you want to keep your lashes for a while for a couple of reuses it's not nasty because you're the only one using it you know unless you have some weird old fun then throw it away but you know you want to just do it on the base so they'll lash longer and they won't look all nasty and clumpy at the top but i do bring it just a little bit up here like whatever's left so there's like barely anything on there and I'll brush it out. So for lips, we're gonna go ahead and go in with Naked 2 for liner, and we're gonna just line our lips. So that way, in case your lipstick comes off, at least you still got a base. And then it also helps if you don't know where your lip line is, and you can't like color in the lines without, you know? This is a helpful trick. But this is Anastasia Beverly Hills in Ashton. Anastasia Beverly Hills. So ready? Here we go. I know that looks funny when you have your mouth open, but it's a lot easier to apply when it is. Until I go like this, so you have a smoother application. I literally like love her lipsticks because though they are kind of on the pricier side, it's not like that horrible because they last all freaking day and all you need is a thin application and it's like on there. Nice and bright yellow. It's like fire. I look like fire because I'm a fire side. Let me know if you guys want to see something like that, like a little zodiac makeup thing. I might as well because... 
doing that for Talk Shit Tuesdays, right? But looks like this concludes it for the eye makeup, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. The mustard yellow eyes, okay, the, uh, I don't know what tone color you want to call that, but Ashton lips, okay, and the bold lashes, of course. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Please share this video with my big old nose piercing, and like and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that bell button because I will see you next time. Remember, two videos per week, y'all, and we'll see you guys Thursday, and then... Next week, we got Capricorn for Talk Shit Tuesday. Love y'all. Bye.